Hey guys, this is Sarah Johnson. Um, this particular video is about uh, EFT, using EFT for uh, grieving the loss of a beloved pet. So, I mean, EFT can be used for all sorts of things, all kinds of issues. I find it really effective to help me deal with uh, feelings of guilt, um, some trauma actually, and um, sadness and responsibility and sort of um, persistent thinking about the loss of one of my pets. So um, Okimo was a golden retriever and he had a rather quick passing in that he sort of fell ill. I found him outside under a tree and within just a few hours, we were saying goodbye to him at the vet's office and there were a lot of different layers and levels to the experience but um the there were things that kept bothering me when i thought about them i mean obviously it was sad it's normal to be sad it's normal to feel grief when you lose um, a pet that you love or anything that you love but if you find that you're getting stuck and I was, I had a little bit of stuckness in, in, um, in that certain parts of the memories were really still hurting a lot when I thought about them. So we call that activation. I was in EFT. If um, thinking about something activates you, so physiologically perhaps you feel like your heart rate increase or maybe emotionally you start to have waves of feelings or maybe what you do is you just push it, push it away. You try not to think about it at all. Um, uh, I was having those sorts of things and I found that EFT was just spectacular in helping free me from uh, feelings of guilt. Um, it helped take away the really deep sting of some of the things that happened that night. Now I can think about Oki with, um, smile. I can smile. Once in a while I still tear up. If I see a dog at the park that reminds me of him, you know, I'll, I can still have emotional reactions to missing Oki. So it's not, this doesn't erase your connection to an animal, a pet. It doesn't take away memories. What it does is, helps bring down the charge of some of the more difficult memories so that you can remember your relationship with your pet more holistically. You can remember the whole uh, breadth of that relationship without just um, focusing in on some um, horrible times and having that dominate your consciousness. So, so EFT can be really healing. So if you'd like to work with me around issues of pet loss, and it doesn't matter if you your pet has just died recently or maybe it was quite a few years ago and you're still bothered on some level or feeling guilty, uh, I can um, I would love to talk to you and see if we can um, work with that. So I have free 15 minute calls to set up a free 15 minute call to see if we work well together, if this will be useful to you. Uh, email me at sejohnsonlmt at gmail.com. You can check out my website, uh, sarahjohnsonwellness.com. But anyway, free 15 minute call, we can just chat and see if what I'm offering is something that would be helpful for you. Okay, so I hope to hear from you. Thanks.